Hey guys, JT here. Welcome back to my channel, JT's Funko Finds. So guys, today I've got an epic find. Uh, it is a dream uh, pop I have been on the hunt for. Um, not like, um, I guess you could say, all the time, but um, if I did see it come up uh, more so in Perth, so that I didn't have to pay for shipping on this, uh, I would definitely be keen to track it down. Uh, so. Uh, you probably have a really good idea from the thumbnail uh, what it is, but um, I did find one in Perth. A guy had it, had it for sale, and he just wasn't replying to any messages. So um, even Stevo, the bearded pop guy, reached out to him, and no, nothing. So I gave up on the idea. Uh, and then recently, I did a, a collection tour, like of all my shelves and everything that I have. And uh, a subscriber by the name of Katie reached out to me. Um, on the channel and then sent me a message over on Instagram and uh, I now have guys this beauty in my hands I'm so excited when I got it home uh, probably for the couple of days after I just kept looking at it I was so happy that I finally have it in my collection and we are talking about this epic Kevin Uphouse. Um I am over the moon I was so so thankful uh, she messaged me on Instagram and said, yes, I've got one available. I guess I'm trying to um, uh, declutter some of my collection. And I noticed you had it, um, had an interest in wanting to get it. So, uh, yeah, so she reached out to me. Uh, we caught up about a, about a week ago now. And um, I picked it up from her. Um, it is in great condition. I am stoked. Uh, I will get it out um, on the turntable so you guys can get a bit of a closer look at him um, and the house. But this now finally, to me, um, if I do get the dug with the cone um, or just dug in general, I'll be happy. But I wasn't too fussed and this was the main one I really, really wanted to go with my Carl and Ellie. Um, so just yeah once again absolutely stoked so thank you again Kay, so much for allowing me to get my hands on this beauty and um when we met up i uh, i quickly looked in the bag you know to look at the alp house and i thought she might, may have left sorry about that my phone started ringing and that's what i record on so uh it stopped the video but um yeah so like i was saying she had um all like what i thought maybe she had left it in the bag for her to take out to continue her shopping because uh, we met up, met up at a local shopping center. And uh, note, she said, I've added in some extra goodies for you. I know you're into like your DC and, and things like that, which um, once again, mind blown, she didn't have to do that at all, but I'm um, very, very happy. And um, so I got, got in the car and I couldn't help myself. I wanted to have a look at what did she chuck in there. So I'll pop that to the side without getting too much glare, but I'm um, absolutely stoked. And um, the first thing I pulled out was this DC Comics. Um, now it's got all the, um, I guess you could say, comics that fe featured in the new um, 52 so series. So um, it's like a massive poster collection. So I think this is absolutely cool. I was just like, oh, this is sweet. Like I've never seen this before. And um, a whole lot of awesome posters that you can pull out and put up on your, um, you know, on, on your collection cupboard or anything like that. But I'm going to leave them all in the in the um, in the book. Uh, I'll try and get past anything that's green because the green screen will probably take effect. But um, there's some really cool ones. I think there's one woman out the back somewhere. So you've got those ones, and then you've got these. But I was I was just baffled i was like you didn't have to do it at all so there's a list of where the i guess the photos had come from from the comic book creations that is part of the 52 line so that was sweet um but she, there was just so many goodies i i didn't know um i, I sent her a message straight away and just thanked her because she didn't have to do this at all and um then i got out now my green screen's gonna go crazy so i might quickly turn it off but um, I pulled this beauty out and I was just in awe. Now these are from the band box collection boxes that you can get uh, from the States. So band box do like a monthly box where it's, uh, I think it's characterized or, you know, to a particular show or movie or character for that month. And um, yeah, so this was in one of her band boxes. Uh, 
she's just put it in there. She obviously enjoys watching the channel and knows that I collect a lot of turtles, what well, my partner does. And so this is actually signed, authenticated by, um, it is signed by Greg Berg, who voiced Donatello and Bebop in the cartoon. So I just thought, wow, like that is insane. Uh, I'll take that off the screen so it's not playing Havoc, but just in, in itself, just to gift me something like this, that is signed, um, that fits our collection perfectly. And um, I was just in awe. So uh, massive thank you, Katie. That was just, just amazing. And then I pulled out this one as well. Uh, once again, from the band box, and it is a, another signed piece. But I think this is by the artist, Chris Ecto. So it is the Joker, which is awesome because, as you guys know, I've got a massive, well, my partner has a massive Batman and Joker line. Um, and I just thought this was so cool. Um, like I say, to gift, gift me something. Um, I put, this is all I was after, the Kevin with the Uphouse. And then for her to come and add those two art pieces uh, with that, plus extras. Uh, it didn't stop there. I just kept pulling out all these awesome things. And uh, so we've got like a little Wonder Woman, um, I guess you, uh, you can sew it on, I guess, to your bag or clothing or uh, I, I don't know where else you, you pop it on, but I'm just gonna leave that in my display cabinet. So I thought, awesome. And then this little, oh, Dorbs, it is amazing. I've never seen it. Uh, I know they do a lot of this in America, and that's where you get your, your band box stuff from. But um, just this little Wonder Woman figurine, which I thought was absolutely neat. So that is now in my collection. And most of this is in my partner's. <laughs> uh, but it's amazing just to get all of this. Um, and also, to add to it, um, are all these amazing band box artist creation cards. So you can see here, I'll start to go through them. This is Cheetah. Now you may have seen in a, a previous video of mine, I purchased a this one here off um, uh, reseller Jenny and Funko Casey. So this is the Cheetah that goes with it. I wasn't, I guess, keen on, on um, getting it because you know me, I was all about Wonder Woman. But now that I've got the two, I can actually I didn't know this, but if you you can actually create it as a, a duo piece to so see how that fits together there. I just thought that was neat in itself. So in a way, I'm glad I didn't buy it off Casey because then, um, well, I, I wouldn't have known actually any otherwise, but um, to get given this is just amazing. And then um, we've also got, well, this is gonna go crazy, but Batman and the Green Lantern. So I think it goes that way. So you can, or is it the other way? Might be the other way. Yeah, so the clouds join, there we go. So it makes like a, a duo piece. So I think you have to get one in one box and another in another box. But um, yeah, uh, Katie collects um, a lot of these band boxes that she gets and these pieces don't fit her collection. So very happy. And then this was another one which I thought was amazing which was the Batman and Joker. And you can see there how it connects. But yeah, once again, I'm in absolute awe. All I was chasing was the up house uh, with Kevin. And then she goes and adds all these really, really cool goodies into the mix. So thank you if you are watching this. Thank you so much again. Uh, does mean a lot because I was not expecting this and um, absolutely over the moon. And uh, my partner has got the turtle piece proudly sitting in her cabinet. So I'll pop all this back to where they were placed. But um, yeah, thank you so much. Um, I am stoked to finally have the up house in my set, in my collection. And uh, I feel, to me, I feel like that set is now complete. Uh, not too fussed about Doug, but hey, if it comes up in a waffle, I might give it a crack. I won't say no. So that's it, guys. Um, thank you, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this because I certainly loved being able to show this beauty off and my little extra pieces. Uh, so thank you once again. If you haven't already, smash that like button, uh, hit that subscription button on the way out, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. See you guys.